They want us to solve this system of equations by any method. So the easiest method to solve something like this is with the elimination method or linear combination sometimes it's called. And so what we're going to do is we're going to multiply this by negative 1. And when we do that we will have a new equation multiplying everything through by negative 1 which is negative 4x minus y equals negative 2. So I'm going to cross that equation out. And now we can take those, the, or that equation along with the first equation, which I'll write back above here, x plus y plus 3.5. And now when I add those two straight down, I'm going to get a new equation, which I'll write in black, which is negative 3x, the y's are gone, equals 1.5. And now I divide both sides by 3x, by, sorry, negative 3. And I get negative 1.5 over 3, which equals negative 1 half. Now that I have x, I can plug that back into either equation, whoops, for x. And when I do, negative 1 half plus y equals 3.5, I see that y must equal 4. And now let's check to make sure that that works by plugging in to that second equation there. Let's plug in negative one-half for x and four for y. And let's see if that equals the correct thing. So negative one-half of four is negative two. Negative two plus four equals two, so that does work. So your solution is negative one-half comma four.